supposed to start raining today, soon. So I want to pull the truck out here because it's going to rain for like three days. And I want to try to get some paint on this thing. So it feels like I'm getting somewhere. Because lately, it feels like I'm doing deck all, Jim. But it happens, I guess. So let's get some freaking paint on this thing together. And we'll see how it looks. I'm just going to go with black because black is the best goddamn color for anything, I think. Leave your comments down below if you agree with me. Because some people will cover up the intakes and the runners and stuff like that. So let's do that. I wasn't gonna, but we will. Because I don't want you some of the bitches to tease me in the comment section and say, I can't believe you didn't tape up the portholes. So we'll tape these up just to make everybody happy. It's probably not a good thing to get paint on your valve stems. Well, I guess it wouldn't freaking hurt the valve stems, but that's not anyway. You don't need a lot of tape, just a little bit. Looks like somebody's already painted the spark plug holes. Okay. You definitely been painted. But let's throw a couple plugs in there too, just to keep the old paint loose up there. I found the plugs I was looking for last time. You couldn't find these, remember? Well, there they are, right there. What do you think of that, eh? Four spark plugs in the holes. Paint, we're gonna use rust oleum steel wear because engines don't get much higher than 200. And 20, and if they do, then you should tone it down a little bit, anyways, because that's too damn hot, you know what I'm saying. Don't worry about the valve covers, because we're not using them. I'm sorry about that, Mike. I should give them back to you actually when maybe I will. Leave a comment down below if you want them back. Why wouldn't you? Look at that, looks better already. Bring it great, does. Yeah. Oh, dick. Oh, yeah. Damn black it is, Captain. One thing nice about this engine, like I said, it's all rebuilt, ready to go. So it's really easy to paint because it's fucking brand new. Captain, can't get any better than that, you can't. Remind me to touch them up when I take it off the stand in there. Looking awesome. I love the flat blacks. Whatever you want to call them. Check it out, Captain. Here we go. Oh, I don't know what I can do. So you're right in the front of the block there, there's a little something something on it. There's always a little something something somewhere. Fucking yeah. great, check that out. You definitely gotta need a few coats. Oh, we gotta do a switch over. Let's get the bottom half first. Dicked over, boys. Should have that off first. Didn't see it there. Sorry about that. Frank. Ooh, hey. Ooh. Okay. Look at that. Frank, yeah. Careful. What do you think, Jim? Oh yeah, I got a piece of my don't I? Oh, fuck it. Just give her a quick coat. It's not gonna hurt the valves. Don't burn the paint right off, Jim. First fire up. There you go. Look at that. Bring it right. Let that set up and then give her another full can of paint. I like the satin black look. I really do. Leave a comment down below if you like it as well. The only problem is do I have another can? Fuck sakes. I'm gonna have to get another can of paint finisher. Friggin' right, I'm gonna have Gosh darn it. I wanna put her on real thick too, so she lasts longer. The motor's been set for eight years with new gaskets in it, so they should seal up pretty good. The silicone should be tacked up pretty good, shit. And I'm gonna put the intake on and stuff, and that's gonna get tacked up for about a month or two before I put the engine in, so we got to pull that one out and clean all the frame up and maybe change the upper and lower control arms again. I don't know. We'll have to see. That's going to look dangerous. What do you see the valve covers I'm going to get for? Man, I'll tell you what, at 49, I haven't got as much ambition as I used to. This would be done the weekend if I was like 20. But now that I'm 160, she don't go as fast anymore. you got to take your time. There's no rush. You can't rush these things, you know. That looks pretty freaking decent. Let me tell you what. There you go, Jim. She's all one color again. Now we slap the intake back on her. 
She looks like a million bucks. Look at that. Brand friggin' new. Just so you know, if you watch the last video, I was only teased when I said 500 horsepower 305. Some of you took that seriously, but uh, we all know, you know, unless I shoot 250 horse nitro shot too, she might hit 500 for a minute. Just a minute though. But yeah, no, she's not enough, nothing like that. She's gonna be good though, because she's got some stuff done to her. So she's not gonna be your stock 305. Ah, <sighs> frig no it's not. There you go, Jim. Buttes. Now I'll slide her back in the corner over there and we'll let her dry till we get another coat of paint. There she is, just like that. Now I feel like I accomplished something today. And I did, I painted my engine. It's pretty freaking decent. Wow. Well, don't say it ever take you long for anything. This is something that's not very much and that's it and this not the other freaking thing, but that's pretty good. Winter's coming quick. Gonna pull the grill out of this truck maybe tomorrow because I gotta fix it. I'll show you why. Probably got the pond all covered up there so leaves don't get in her for the winter. But yeah, this insert I put in on the grill should come loose. So I gotta take the grill off it and we'll fix that. And then we'll start uh, yanking the rest of the motor part. I just start a few things. Not too many things, but I started a few things, but it still runs. So I didn't want to take off too much because I got to move it still for now. Friggin' right. Can't wait till the next one. Now we just got to paint the transmission, which will do the same color. We'll do it in black as well because we are going to put that in. There's no sense in changing the engine and putting the old put it in reverse and count the 20 and uh, transmission back in her because that transmission's had it. Friggin' right, it's had it. But until the next one, we'll see you then.